War I lasted from 1914 until 1918. In the end, much of Europe was in ruin. The Allies had triumphed and Germany had been defeated, and it was time for payback. The Allies, though America objected, presented the German government with a bill for 132 billion gold marks. That's billion with a B. It was twice Germany's annual income. Desperate, facing a bill they didn't have the money to pay, the Germans did just what America's Continental Congress did in 1777. They fired up the printing press and pumped out the paper. At the end of the war, one dollar would buy roughly four marks. Five years later, one dollar would buy 4.2 trillion marks. That's trillion with a T. Ordinary citizens suffered the most. Germany's birth rate fell and the death rate rose. Infant mortality climbed by 21%, and on the black market, cigarettes became the new money. The government's money was so worthless, a whole wheelbarrow of it couldn't buy a loaf of bread. You might as well use it for wallpaper, for kindling. By 1930, all that crazy, out-of-control printing of money had destroyed the economy of Germany.